this is Chris Giannetti with DetroitUnderground.com giving a recap of my final day of Movement 2012. Um, the first act that I was really, really impressed by um, on Monday um, was definitely Keys and Crates on the Red Bull stage. Um, they had a really, really cool setup. They had a guy playing synth, uh, they had a guy playing a live drum set, and they had a guy on turntables and MPC. They were basically performing and remixing songs live. Um, and they were really, really great performers, uh, really enjoyable performance to watch. Uh, a couple hours after that, on the same stage, Arab Music played, um, and that guy is really incredible. Um, he somehow can bang on an MPC really like precisely and intensely for an hour, and I don't know how he does it. Um, but just like playing beats for an hour straight, like he's he's pretty incredible. Um, and of course, ending the night, major laser, um, kind of indescribable. <laughs> I mean, people told me about their show, and I honestly wasn't sure what to expect. But it's really high energy, they have a great MC, uh, Diplo and Switch are really great performers. Just like seeing them just get up on the speaker stacks and like shoot streamers into the audience and take their clothes off and like tell the audience to swing their clothes around above their heads. and. I don't know, all sorts of crazy things. Like, they are really intense and really, really awesome. I mean, if if you get the chance to see them, you know, I'll, I would go see them again. Um, and honestly, this year was a great festival overall. Um, getting to see Fotech and getting to see Ronnie Size and getting to see Public Enemy um, and, of course, you know, Arab Music and Major Lazer, like, you know, I saw a lot of acts that I was really, really looking forward to see this year. And uh, I just hope next year is, you know, even better. Thanks.